have it. Yeah, we do. Alright, so, for our first game this evening, we're going to be looking at The Mall. This was a, an Xbox 360 title released by Twisted Pixel of Explosion Man fame, which I bought a long time ago but never got around to actually playing. So, I have no idea what we're going to get into tonight, but let's take a look. played this game. So, let's see what's happening here. I have a ton of DLC for this as well, and I have no idea what it does either. how cute he looks. He's not going to try and eat me, is he? Knocked out a lot at the start of this game. Alright, there we go. All the blinking question mark. Even the music cues sound like from Explosion Man. I know what's going to happen here. Looks like we do have, there's a fixed limit of things to eat. Get him. Is he gonna follow us, or I think we need to use the leash. <laughs> Come on, buddy. Isn't this how the blob started? <laughs> just keep feeding him, making him bigger, and soon he's just gonna eat every bite. Come on, buddy. His tongue looks even uh, more drooling this time. Alright. 
So X for him, B for creatures. Oh, I'm sorry, B for objects. For some reason, I'm getting a Space Station Silicon Valley feel out of this too, the old N64 game. Can he eat him? Oh, no, he's not big enough yet. Does he like water? Well, at least he's not afraid of water. Alright, so he gets a lot bigger. Uh-oh. Get you someone to eat. Get him. I'm guessing those things are kind of like the gate to the next area. Oh, it's getting bigger. And yet the collar stays on him, all the same. Anything over here? It could have been Elgordo, this could have been one of the first XBLA games. Oh, what are you? Oh. I guess he really liked eating that guy. Yeah, I think I know where the fire lizard is. I think he's back at the start. There he is. But of course, we have to look for all the jiggies or whatever we're calling these things. Hey, Dan. Thanks for coming on. Come on, buddy. Eat. Oh. <laughs> Alright, I guess he's not ready to eat those guys yet. Oh. 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 Oh, I get it. We have to throw him in the water? Boy. You got someone to eat over here. Yeah, I can see the personality already in this Elgardo. It is really nice. Oh. Oh. Holy crap. He's on fire. Oh. Get him. Get him, you. Can I lift that? No. Oh, so they're hiding in the trees. Oh. I'm assuming we can't kill these things. We can only eat them. And when they're lit on fire, they get stunned. Hopefully he gets like a little bit more like rapid fire eating. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh, so he's big enough now to get through them. Yep, definitely. Style over graphics indeed. Eat him. Come on, get him. Uh, we're getting there. Did I go this way yet? 
Yeah, we did. Burn the tree. Yeah, Subs a Zombie was alright. Uh oh. Is he on a little cool wall there? Come on, buddy. Get out of here. <laughs> yeah, the fire right here. Just burn it all. Get him. Get over here, you. Eat him. So many things are setting on fire. Alright, 12 more. Come on, buddy. Another very interesting, like, action puzzle game, Hurdy Gurdy for the PS2. And that one you had to herd various animals who had, like, different behaviors. Hmm, I wonder if I can... Is there anything up here for me? Oh, I can. Oh, I didn't realize we could do that too. Get over here. Oh. Oh, cool. And throw him right in his mouth. And I guess we'll find a few more. Yeah, buddy. <laughs> and you. Oh no. There's one left. Which game is that? Oh. It is a little shame that he's not, like, he's not running very fast. Kind of hope he could move a little bit quicker there. I'm not gonna spend too long walking around, so I'm gonna do one more quick pass. And if he doesn't, if we don't see the last one, we'll just move on. I got that. <laughs> this is Lassie's evil brother here. Oh, do I even own more? That's always a challenge, right? I don't even remember what games I own. Come on, buddy. Alright, let's just get going then. Get him. <laughs> Ian per minute. Going back to what we were saying a few minutes ago, the style really does hold up well. So I know this game's gotta be at least 
what, like seven years old by now? Probably even more than that. Get. Come on, buddy. Let me just run again, electrical upgrade. So those uh, big mosquito things must be the bones collectible. Mall is at least 2007. Damn. That is a while ago. No, oh, don't hit my creature. Quicker to grab them and put them in his mouth. There you go. Enjoy. Still a while ago. At least he's following. I mean, this is when we learn about whipping the enemies. And... Yeah. Good throw. there. Thanks for the dodge there. I kind of wish the, our character was just a little bit faster, like I said, like, it's slowing things down a little bit. Maybe we'll get the ability to run at some point. So I need to grab another one of those electrical orbs. What is that? some grappling now. And I'm gonna assume we're going to 
have to jump to another one soon. Oh, thanks for that, Ogre. I won't mention it on stream in case that's maybe a spoiler for people watching. Uh oh, did I go the wrong way? <laughs> uh, there's a shocking plot twist here. Alright, so now. We blow that up. Electrocuting now. Oh. Oh. Well, that worked. Get him. Yeah. I have a feeling this wasn't going to be a very long game. Just because of the design here. Like, there's only so much you can do with mechanics like this without just becoming long or feeling drawn out. Alright, what are we going to learn now? Can I break this? Yep. <laughs> eh, he doesn't want to eat that. faster. not going. I 
like he's willing to shot that turn. Come on. They want us to blow that thing up. All right, come on, buddy, let's go. The voice reminds you of Al. <laughs> So happy with himself. Get him. Come on, boy, let's go. So they get big enough to kill those guys. Cool. You got a lot to eat on this level. This will all make sense in a minute. <laughs> yeah, that's regular. That was the old getting stuck on wall physics on first generation 3D or early. Can't be any heavy on this waterfall, right? Nope. Alright, so we turn the water on. Is that thing still here? inside that plant. Oh, there are those things that are going to scare him. <laughs> they want 
take the somewhat of a long way back. are so slow in this. I don't think we're big enough to eat the fire guys yet. Oh, yes we are. Now you can get it. Time to burn everything again. that. Good old exploding barrels. One second. There we go. Let's miss one over here. Alright, and you go. <laughs> this is another one of those games that could be very disturbing if we were dealing with more realistic graphics. I see you over there. How are you gonna eat those guys? Even bigger. Okay, so we have to go up, hit the thing up there. Yeah, the cuteness saves the day. Right, what do we have up here? What is this? A mine? Hmm. Alright buddy, let's go. You got some food to eat. Guess he likes his dinner cooked. Are we going to eat on this level? Alright, so I'm going to ram the guy over there. Pyromaniac, isn't he? Anything more to eat over here? I 
after him. And we'll play this for probably like another 20-30 minutes right up to the hour. And then we'll switch to game number two. I wonder if this is the level when we start to get comically huge. <laughs> Alright, so we have a portal over there. I mean, yes, we're gonna eat him. Look at that. That solves that, I guess. Alright, what do we have over here? That's where we came from. Still a whole lot to eat. Hopefully everyone had dinner before they came on to watch. Something to break through. Hmm. We're going to slide down. Then I must have missed something back here. <laughs> yeah, this is the wooling that's killing me. You're moving just so slow. Give me a run, please. Alright, so. Oh! Go get him. Come on, slide faster. We're eating creatures to gain their powers. This truly is the Dark Souls of Metroidvania. <laughs> Just 
keep going forward until there's nothing left. some manipulation of him. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. I just pulled myself out of the world. Yeah, the controls are probably the least refined part of the game, I think. But, considering this was like the first, I think, of this kind of Twisted Pixel, I can't get too mad about it. Wait, can I do something here? creatures we need to eat. Hmm. What is going on? He's not picking him up. Yeah, fast eat option I think would be helpful too in this. even close here in terms of eating these guys. I would say like a mass lasso would be a really good option for this game. Eating. 
we've only one of these. So that's enough for the level. That's a nice little animation I'm using his tongue there. Alright, for the sake of this not turning into like an hour play just on this level, we'll just make our way to the exit. If we can find it, that is. There's the exit. Don't tell me we can eat the soldier. Oh my god. Alright, we can eat the soldier. Caterpillars. Or those snails. making Escort go tonight. Man, we made this song without making a you are what you eat joke, too. I'm proud of the chat. <laughs> Alright, so we have fire and we have snails. Free the big guy, then he rams those guns. Oh. I 
see a shiny up there. What could it mean? That thing will blow up on me. That thing? There we go. Alright, come and get him. Come on, buddy. It's dinner time. This guy could be in Pokemon. It'll make life a lot more interesting. Alright, so we need to head back up. What if I can burn the snails now? if he would like learn just do that from the start instead of having to do, repeat the animation. Break that thing's chains, and then we can get going. Uh, looks like we have about seven minutes, so I think we'll finish this level up. I want to reload the chat to be on the safe side, and we'll move on to our second game. I'm sure you can break that stuff now. There we go. Does that mean we can't leave yet? Yeah, I have a feeling it's gonna stop me. <laughs> Alright, I gotta say, I love the animations for this guy. Uh, sate his hunger some more. We... Um, burn him. Again, this game could be so much more disturbing with a different style. 
between the pyromania uh, and just devouring everything. I got an achievement for burning too many things. <laughs> Alright, in you go. And we're just the accomplice in all this. Bigger soon. All right, now he's happy. While we're wrapping it up too, by the way, if you guys want to see, like, I guess, a quick playthrough of the rest of the mall after the Saturday Night Grabback stream, let me know. Because what well, Gore was saying is that it's not that long of a game. I'm sure we could probably finish it in one full night of streaming. Alright, eat your uh, little drug bug here. <laughs> There is DLC, but I'm not sure what that actually does or not, or if it does like anything substantial. Alright, come on you. Hmm. This is actually a really good example for when I do a critical thought uh, that fans suggested about memorable characters and some tips or tricks for designing them. Hopefully I'm going the right way. There it is. <laughs> Alright, that's level. Alright. Let me see here. Oh. oh, the DLC is apparently like a uh, like deleted scenes from the various levels where you play as different characters who aren't the Maw. Hmm. That's interesting. I think I have to access it from outside the game. I'm curious. Let me check that out before we say goodbye to the mall for tonight. It's one of those things that has to be accessed from outside the game. That's uh, disconcerting. Okay, so there's one, two, three. Alright, let's see what brute force is. Let's do something. Hmm. But what? 
wait a minute. Huh. I, hmm. I wonder the DLC is the actual level itself. We did that, we did that. I think that's what I'm that's what this is. So, like, this whole level is the DLC, and so is River Redirect and the Speeder Lane. Man, if that's true, and this game is even shorter than I thought. So it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight levels long, not counting DLC. Alright, well, it's good to know. Alright, for those of you watching this recorded, that's